Hello everybody. We're back with another Clash of Clans video. It's the next day after the war. Actually, it's the end of the war day. And we're going to go through our highlights. So we got here. This is FFG Dad attacking Super Shubham. So we go in. It looks like it started out with a uh, Barbarian. Get that clan cl castle troop out there. And then we come in with giants. And then we come out with our clan castle troops, our archers, our barbarians, and then we just let it go. We move through pretty quickly. Um, I don't have any rage spells or anything on this one, but we go through, we wipe them out, we get the three star on this one, and then we'll move on to the next one. Just let it wipe the rest of it out and then we got the three star and then we'll jump on and check out the next one on the next attack I use a lava loon it's uh I decimate him because I'm way higher level than he is but this is uh with Sarthak so Samantha's army or Sam Master against Sarthak I come out with the lava hounds speed them up well, actually it's rage and then my balloons and then we put this the hay spell down and it's a real quick cleanup I, there was no competition I, I'm way over leveled for this guy but I wanted the three star I didn't three star the one that uh, uh, my level was I think I got one star in it but we'll check it out next that's the next one in line now on this one I'm going up against uh, King something or other what is it King Avishak uh, now I use a baby loon, right? So baby dragons and balloons. So I come out with those golems, then bring in my my king. Then we got the baby dragons. I speed up the baby dragons. I'll come out with those haste spells. Oh, well, balloons first, then the haste spells. What was that haste? That was rage spells. And then we put haste spells on the other side of that. And then we dump the rest of our troops in. And if you notice, everything goes in the middle like it should be. But that dragon from their clan cast comes out and wipes out my center. I would have had a two star on this, but that dragon took out my troops right in the middle that were going for their base. And that that really wasn't good. All right, so we move on to the next one, which is Sarthak, Sarthak King. So Sarthak King was attacked by um, Shade King. He comes in from the right. He's got the spell. Throws down that lightning spell. Weakens those walls. But uh, Shade King's troops aren't really all that high. But I think this is a good strategy. He weakens the walls. Brings in his giants. And then backs them up with wizards. And then his... Uh, his king and queen. Now I really believe if he would have done this right he could have made it to that center. Like right now a rage would have been nice. And then come in with that rage would have covered the inside of that and then threw another haste spell on there or a jump. If he would have had a jump rage take out that spot jump spell jumped in the middle raged in the middle he could have got that that uh, town hall and and had a, a star on that but now what's left of his troops are on the outside cleaning up and all we can do is hope for a one star a 50 percent one star i don't think we make it but we'll watch it he's got his pekkas down there walking around the outside and that's all that's left those pekkas all in all it's not bad the strategy if done right would have worked well but uh, Shade King's levels are, are a little low for his town hall. He's uh, he's neglected his town hall. All right, so we're moving back to the other side, to our side, so we can show you what what happened to us. All right, so where are we going from here? So we're on go down to FFG Dad, and he was attacked by Sarthak MK. We got a 100% three star. Now I have since changed my my war base around he came out he got my clan castle troops out 
with archers and then attacked them with wizards and got rid of those so they they I got rid of a few of his guys but not enough to even make a dent but he comes in takes out my clan castle throws those uh giants in there and the giants just come in and rip up my defenses heal spell yeah he came in this was very a very good attack on me uh, I believe that Sarthak is hot Sarthak MK is over my level anyway it's kind of like with my lava hounds like I did on him or not him exactly but on his on the other character but he comes in wipe me out three star but I have since changed my war base around so they're not going to be able to do that again so we'll move on to Aaron's base and uh, I think it's a well put together base it's a, I th it's very symmetrical I like symmetrical I always like symmetrical but uh, they again they come out they lure out the clan castle troops and that baby dragon takes quite a few of them but not enough to make a dent in the hole because they still three star them. Then they're jumping in there with their giants, taking out the air defense, healing spell. You know those healing spells must work really well on those giants. I don't use healing spells all that much on uh, the Sandmaster account, but this guy, it's working out for him. Oh, we're going to fast forward it. We're going to look through. We, the Giants go through, take out all the defenses, and all the quick cleanup. And another three star for the other team. How about that? Now we'll move on. What's the next one up? The one. We'll check out the one. And uh, let's get that replay going. So the one has a fish base. It looks like a fish. That's actually kind of cool that it's a fish. They again lure out the clan castle troops. And those, yeah, they, they come out with minions. And those minions start hitting them. And then, uh, I don't know what they set out next. What are those? Oh, miners. So you can see they are actually way over his level. These miners, you can't get miners until, I what, level Town Hall 12 maybe? Maybe it's 10 or 11. I don't know. I'm Town Hall 9 on uh, Sandmaster, and I don't have them yet. So they easily go in, take everything out, and uh, another 3-star for the other team. But I think, I think that's a cool-looking base. It is. It's a fish. All right, so let's move on to Shade King. Or Shade King. No, we'll we'll hit Sam Master first. We'll check out Sam Master. Nobody hit Sam Master. I think it's a very it's a very well maintained well of course it's mine, so it's it's I'm gonna say good things about it. But I have been on it. Uh all my everything except for the walls and a couple dark elixir troops are upgraded. Well my king and queen aren't upgraded completely yet. But we are you know, I'm working on it. It takes a long time. I mean, you got 90,000 Dark Elixir that you have to get, and you can only get like 2,000 Dark Elixir per raid. Well, we'll move on. Enough about my base. Shade King. Shade King is being de uh, defeated by, yeah, of course, I'm giving away the future, King Avakish. Now, this is a slop, we, yeah, it's a slop, sloppy put together. We, we just did, it was real quick. Uh, Shade King is not an avid clasher. He just joined the clan so we can start doing clan wars. So he does, he, he's, his heart is, whoa, what was that? Falling from the sky, giants. That was cool. Giants were just falling from the sky. Anyway, so get back. Okay, now yeah, those giants have got me all frazzled. I can't even think of what I was talking about now. Alright, so it looks like the enemy is coming in from the top with their giants, and it's giants falling from the sky. All right, anyway, giants, the healing spell. You know, I've noticed these guys use their healing spell on their giants. You know, I'm going to start doing that. Maybe when I use giants, I don't hardly ever use giants anymore. I should throw healing spells in there. 
Now, he also threw in his king and the queen because there is a gap, looks to be a gap in between our walls in the upper right-hand corner of our, our, our clan base. This whole base, like I said before, is to get them funneled into the middle so that way all our true our, our defenses can focus on everybody in the middle. Yeah, it's a, it's not very well planned, but it works and I have to thank Shade King for joining our clan so we can do these raids. He's not, like I said before, an avid clan clash of clan player, but he does get on when he can and uh, we do need to thank him for that shout out for Shade King and uh, so they're gonna come in they're gonna finish him up they the uh, got his clan castle they're gonna two-star him and I'll just we'll just sit back and wait for this to finish never mind I'm gonna talk through it I just sped this part up so that way we can hurry up and get through it because they, they come in they only got a couple of troops I was six now two archers left to come in clean the place up a little bit and then move on they got their two stars and here we go and at the end of that the old war was ended so I jump over I collect my treasury so that way I can come in here and grab archers now I was live streaming this on twitch and I took a vote and th my uh, followers, I guess they're called, voted for the archer. So that's why I upgraded the archer. Um, I probably would have picked the archer anyway, but I like to have that thing. Oh yeah, I'm on Twitch now. I just let everybody know I'm on Twitch. I will have a link, maybe, it might be a link, I'll have in the description uh, to our Twitch channel. It's called Video Gaming Family. Family Fun Gaming was already taken, so we're Video Gaming Family. So I'll put that in the description so you can watch us live on Twitch. And because I'll be I'll be doing this first thing in the morning, I'm gonna call it uh, Clash in the Morning or Wake Up to Clash. I don't know. I still don't. I'm not sure. I think Clash in the Morning actually sounds okay. It's not a bad thing. Clash in the Morning or clash with my morning joe i don't know we'll, we'll figure it out it's a work in progress so we're still staring okay there we go war is ended and we lost 8 to 11. now i was looking at this i'm not going to upgrade that until tomorrow morning and we're going to start our master builder nighttime base tomorrow and there we go that was the end thank you for watching make sure you subscribe and like and get over there to Twitch and uh, start watching us live on Twitch. We'll see you on the next one.